The world's first living robots are now capable of reproducing, albeit through a somewhat unconventional method. China has developed a mind-reading helmet. Japanese companies are fully engaged in the development of next-generation exoskeletons. But that's not all. Very soon, Japan will witness the mass deployment of autonomous vehicles with giant protruding eyes on the roads, humanoid robots, snake robots, and all the latest news from the world of high technology in one video. We all know the robot Emeka, which according to developers, most closely aligns with the collective vision of what humanoid robots will look like in the future. However, Emeka is far from being the first hyper-realistic robot released by Engineered Arts. Over the past few years, the company has created a whole lineup of realistic robots called Mesmer, each designed and built based on 3D scans of real people. This approach allows developers to convincingly mimic the structure of human bones, the texture of skin, and facial expressions. However, Mesmer robots appear much more ominous compared to Emeka with its transparent plastic skull. What are your thoughts on engineered art's concept of future robots? The Georgia Tech robotic musicianship group has unveiled the results of its research. As part of the project, engineers taught robotic hands to react unpredictably to the movements of dancers and music. The goal was for both humans and robots to surprise and inspire each other. As noted by the authors, in the case of success, both humans and robots will dance differently than before they met. China has developed a mind-reading helmet to detect if a person is viewing adult content. Such content is prohibited in the country, and to monitor and filter it from the internet and social media, the technology uses both artificial intelligence and reportedly human sensors. The helmet is specifically designed for the latter. Scientists found that an image of nudity, even if displayed for just half a second among a stream of other images, caused surprise from the viewer. This particular spike in brain waves is what the device detects. Austin Robotics has secured nearly $15 million for the development of the Aptronic robot and exoskeletons. Both products are designed for applications in healthcare, the military, space, and more. The humanoid robots will be autonomous, but the specific tasks they will be able to perform independently are not yet specified. The company's exoskeletons, on the other hand, are intended to improve the strength and endurance of their pilots. The Japanese company A Town is creating unique exoskeletons. For instance, the lower limb exoskeleton coma allows the operator to transport heavy loads on a straight surface and ascend stairs with them. To switch between modes, transformation is required. The exoskeleton has retractable wheels at the front of the legs and stationary ones under the heels. On the waist, there are handles with controllers through which the person controls all the actions of the structure. A town also has a full body exoskeleton, which the company positions as an extremely powerful power suit that improves human capabilities. It looks quite interesting, although a little rough. In the ground sector, companies such as Sacros Robotics are making significant strides in creating lightweight snake-like robots capable of reaching virtually any corner and crevice. For example, the Guardian S robot maneuvers in confined spaces and explores hard-to-reach areas. It navigates through uneven and rough terrain, challenging gravity by climbing vertical pipes. Guardian S is equipped with 360-degree cameras, a set of LED lights, two-way audio communication, and a variety of other sensors, including GPS. It is used for pre-launch inspections of oil and gas assets, where it can efficiently and easily identify everything from debris to structural integrity issues. The robot can be additionally equipped with sensors for detecting gas or radiation. The Illum robot, developed by a subsidiary of the Norwegian University of Science and Technology, is permanently based underwater and regularly performs inspection, repair, and maintenance of underwater communications. The robot connects to a docking station on the seabed, simplifying deployment compared to a typical remotely operated robot that needs to be lowered from the surface. The robot is a modular system consisting of sensors, joints, motors, cameras, and light sources. It can dive to depths of up to 500 meters and operate either fully autonomously or under operator control. When extended in a straight line, Elam can quickly reach a specified target and its flexible body allows it to navigate through very narrow spaces. Any part of the robot's body can accommodate various sensors and tools. The robot can take video or skillfully manipulate objects with the manipulator attached to its end. 
The day has come. The world's first living robots are now capable of something crucial for the survival of any species. Reproduction. You heard it right. Now robots will be able to create new versions of themselves in an unconventional way. Organisms known as xenobots are employing a completely new form of biological self-replication. The researchers found that these machines can gather hundreds of individual cells and combine them to create offspring, xenobots. After a few days, the offspring evolve to look and move just like their parents. The offspring can then repeat this process many times. While xenobots can independently produce offspring, the system usually dies shortly after, allowing the parents to witness the growth of their offspring. Researchers turned to artificial intelligence for assistance. They discovered that a designed AI parent could use its mouth to compress stem cells into a round offspring, and then the offspring produced grandchildren, great-grandchildren, and so on. The research results raise certain concerns, but the researchers anticipate more optimistic outcomes. They believe their system could contribute to the development of various technologies, from living machines that clean microplastics to new medicines. Researchers from the University of Oxford and Google DeepMind have released a study in which they stated that advanced artificial intelligence could lead to, in their words, catastrophic consequences for humanity. The article makes the following arguments. If artificial intelligence is allowed to independently seek ways to achieve its goals, it is likely to strive for reward rather than the well-being of humanity. According to the authors, everything will quickly go wrong. A sufficiently advanced artificial intelligence will likely intervene in the process of securing its target information with catastrophic consequences for humanity. According to the article, the first sign of danger will be the ability of artificial intelligence to outperform humans in any game. Researchers say that the catastrophic consequences are not just possible, but highly likely. Let's move to Japan, where in the near future, autonomous vehicles will become widespread on the roads. This means that the interaction between pedestrians and vehicles not operated by humans will significantly increase. Researchers are thinking about how to make these interactions safer. They have come up with a new and unusual method. Japanese innovators suggest installing giant protruding eyes on the cars. They have already conducted experiments with autonomous golf carts to see if this innovation can reduce the number of traffic incidents. Researchers found that people surprisingly will to cross the road when an eye-catching golf cart approached. Participants stated that they felt safer and more confident crossing the road when the protruding eyes were looking at them. The company Skyline, promoting a robotic system for washing windows of skyscrapers, has attracted $6.5 million in funding for business development. The Osmo system includes two industrial robotic arms mounted on a suspended platform. They use LiDAR to determine the proximity to the glass and force sensors to ensure that nothing is damaged in the process. The robot operates based on artificial intelligence and machine learning. Integrated algorithms provide stability to the robotic arms in strong wind conditions and recalculate the optimal cleaning path hundreds of times per minute. Write in the comments what you think about these new generation technologies. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the Kara Show channel. Also, check out our previous videos. See you next time.